More on the eclipse now and how animals will react. Scientists around the country ready for the opportunity to study animal behavior. And Zoo My Miami wildlife expert Ron McGill joins us now. Tell us what to expect today. Well, you know, most animals aren't going to do anything at all. People are expecting, you know, all the bats are going to come flying out of the cave and all the owls are going to... That's, that's not going to happen. Generally speaking, this is kind of like a delayed jet lag for these animals. You know, it's like when you fly to the other side of the country, you say it's 2 o'clock in the morning, you get out of the plane, the sun's wide open, you go, oh my gosh, so you're a little out of whack. Having said that, they've seen some changes in the past. For instance, birds might stop flying, they might stop singing. On the flip side, you might have an owl start going, oh, hoo, hoo, hoo. <laughs> you'll hear crickets maybe start calling. Fireflies may start to, to light up. Remember, the sun is the, is the clock for animals, so that's what gets them going. But it's such a short amount of time, and we really don't have a lot of data, so we don't know. And there are zoos like Living Desert in California. They're not on the, the path of, to, of the totality, but they're setting up cameras to study animals. What do you think they'll learn? Absolutely. Well, you know, like I said, they did it back in 2017 at the South Carolina Zoo. This is going to be the Fort Worth Zoo. It's going to be in full, uh, full path. We don't know. We really don't know. We don't have a lot of data. Understand that this is something that happens very infrequently. When it happens, it's only a few minutes. People say, oh, totality. I saw the Galapagos tortoises mating. But you know what? They were mating an hour before then, too, or two hours after that. So it's hard to say, you know, whether it's coincidence or it's the eclipse. But you'll see things like bees will go back to the hive. The animals like, you know, horses and cattle will go back into the stable and think, hey, it's getting dark. But for most animals, it's like a, a big storm's approaching. You know, they, they might hunker down or whatever, but it's not this epiphany of like, oh my gosh, the world is changing. Most animals won't do much at all. Unless you talk to your dog and you get the <laughs> inside scoop from your, your pet dog at home. Well, you know, for your pets, I would keep them inside. I would turn on the lights, turn on some music, just keep them calm that way because if they don't see that change, they won't react to it. Oh, my days he's going to sleep through it anyway. It's exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. We're going to have more sure. of the Eclipse coverage coming up. And Robin Lee put our full coverage on Eclipse Across America starting at 1 p.m. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.